The legendary rocker prefers to work on his model railway. The committed star also refuses to speak to preserve his voice while on the road and insists on starting his shows bang on time. In fact, Rod, 78, says his only major addiction is performing. He wrapped up his 11-year residency in Las Vegas last week after notching up hundreds of shows for loyal fans. He said, that two hours on stage is the most potent drug you can imagine. It's highly addictive. It's the bloody in-between time I don't like, sitting in hotel rooms. Although when I'm sat around like that, I build my model railroad so that I'm not idle. It's something I'm working on for five or six hours a day. While all the banders are sitting around picking their noses, I'm occupied. To preserve his vocal cords, he also admits, I wear a sign that says, doctor's orders, can't speak, voice rest. I'm particular about that. I also like to start the show right when it's announced, whether the place is full or not, whether people are late coming in or not. Anybody can tell you that in Vegas I go on at 7.30 p.m. sharp. I like to think I've always been a true professional and that hasn't changed. Next year, Rod will team up with fellow model railroad enthusiast Jules Holland for a swing album, Swing Fever. The duo have covered James Brown's classic hit Night Train for the album, out in February, and are already eyeing a number of small gigs across the UK. And Rod says a return to the US could be on the cards with Lady Gaga proving swing cells in Vegas, thanks to her current jazz piano residency on the famous strip. He says, I'm not sure what's next. Purely, I love Caesar's Palace. They treat me like a king. But I've made a swing album with Jules Holland and really want to start singing that stuff. I want to promote it. If I go back to Vegas, maybe I could do a swing show, big band stuff. Who knows? Lady Gaga is a good singer. Become an Express Premium member support Fearless Journalism Read the Daily Express online. Advert free get super fast page loading start 30 day free trial next year will see Rod immortalised in spirit at the Ritz in London, thanks to his recent investment in the Scottish liquor company Wolfie's Whiskey. The Five Star Hotel will honour the star in time for Burns Night in January by naming a drink after his 1991 hit Rhythm of My Heart.